Hey guys, welcome back to some more Alice Madness Returns. Uh, hopefully we don't see that. Yeah, I think we're gonna see that. Uh, that's um, holy shit. Well, I certainly begun it on a very high note. There's a lot of dead fish here on hooks. Hmm. Well, I hope you're uh, not squeamish. Man, and I, I think I was talking about how this game wasn't creepy enough. Oh well. We'll avoid that for the time being. What have you gotten yourselves into? What have I got myself into? Okay, so we have to use this thing. What does that even do? Ah! Oh, you game. Alright, and where does this actually bring us up to? Oh. Oh. We're going here. There's no time to waste. There's no time at all. Okay, so I have to kill everything in this one. This is killer to be. Oh, shit. Okay, we'll leave this guy until the end. Oh, great. Okay, so this is the plan. We're gonna attack this guy. And we got one. Okay, that's that's one down. But no, you're supposed to get stunned. Because I told you to. I know I see him with the with that little bomb thing. Maybe I maybe one of them I can divert over. Here. Oh shit. Well, maybe maybe not. Okay, I think we're good now. Nothing else gonna spawn? I think we got it now. Thing is, I can, I can technically go ahead and, uh... I, can, I have no choice of either pepper gun or so, anything or something else. I, I actually, I still like the pepper gun because I'm very much a ranged guy. Even though he's gonna like throw them back at me occasionally. Okay, I was near the edge there. That was uh, slightly concerning. Honestly, it probably would be more worthwhile for me to, to try and sort his ass. Oh, there we go. We got one. What? Oh, crap. Alright, we'll just, uh, well, actually we can pepper him while he does this. Oh, what? He only did one? Oh, wow, okay. I didn't actually, I thought he was, like, getting hit. You gotta really watch out for that. Now he's dead. Oh, fuck, there's more! Uh... Holy shit! Do you think he had enough teacups? And that thing again? By the way, there's absolutely no healing. Oh my god. That is fucking relentless. You know, that last part was kind of hard, so I'm like, eh. Okay, let's go and, uh... I don't know, they're gonna be all nuking me from long range. I, I need to, like, clump them all together or something. Oh, I got hit. Wait, wait. This is gonna be the only chance I get to do anything. I'm fucking it up. Wonderful.
Okay, I gotta get the hell out of here. Because I'm worried about... Oh, God. This, that kind of a thing. Holy shit. There's, like, no healing available for me whatsoever. Why do I have a feeling I'm gonna be montaging this in about a second? Alright. Got that. Two more teacups left. I'm so fucking worried right now. It's really intense for me right now. I can't, like, just jump into the teacups. I know, I know you're, like, watching me. I'm, like, evading them. Uh-oh. Wait. Did he lose his arm? No, he didn't. Alright. Nope. Didn't do it. Eh. Okay, get the hell out of here. Okay, only one teacup left. But now, it's, now it gets easier. Except there's that guy there. Oh, I got greedy. Okay. Alright, well I'm back and I'm almost taking out this motherfucker. I'm worried about... It's like the exact same goddamn situation I was just in. Oh my god. Uh, he woke up at just that exact moment. Oh well, it's okay if I fell off the edge. That's fine. I have no health, by the way. I just need to mention. I've got more ballsy when it comes to these guys, actually. Like this. Especially when they're bringing out that stuff. I could do a lot more attacks. So ballsy. Oh god. I have to watch out for that. I keep doing that, like, straight backwards. Oh my god, every fucking time I'm... Ah, uh, balls of steel, guys. <laughs> Come, Alice, don't dawdle. You've already missed the train! It was really dumb of me to, like, go back against those guys, but that's okay. Well, I got another rose out of that. Whew. Alright. Adrenaline's pumping. Yeah, we're out. Yeah, and the reward is a single tooth. It just kind of resets all the teeth, it looks like. Yeah. Love rewards. Not really rewards. Oh, okay, so back on our merry way here. Oh, wait, wait. Do you guys see that? Look at that shit. It's an invisible one. You have to... Uh... Well... I kind of have to know, I guess. Oh, you, you can hear them. You can do it purely by visual aid kind of thing. Look, there's a little secret here. Oh. I love secrets. It's a bottle. That's all it is. And that's it. There's, like, nothing else telling me what to do. Okay, so here's the creepiness. They look like... These guys actually have legs. Oh, they're fish with legs. They're mermen, or whatever. Mermaids. That's, um... It's, this brings me back to Diablo 1, that, that the butcher's, uh, lair thing. Yeah. So... Every picture tells a story. Sometimes we don't like the ending. Sometimes we don't understand it. Is it shrimp here? Oh. With a saw on its head. Oh, well, that's, uh. pleasant. He's still alive, too. It's horrible. Oh, he's, he's like crucified or some shit. Oh, oh, well, no, not really. He's, it's ropes tying him to that. 
Still, he's got a saw in his head. I imagine that's not very desirable. And look at this guy. He was like even torn open like a like a butterfly. Why am I? This is like so gory. Why am I looking at this? Because you guys love it, don't you? All right, what's up here? Okay, I can't go down here. No, you know, there's gotta be a purpose to this area. I can't even fall down here, like, if I like want to die on purpose. Well. I don't really see any secrets, so. Well, the show must go on. Uh. Where the hell are we? Nobody really knows. So, there's a thing that way, and this door doesn't actually appear to open, so... I guess there's only one way left to go. We gotta meet the good old carpenter. Hey, it's an octopus, or octopi. Oh, we came, came out the other way. Oh, let's go, let's go look at the show. That's quite enough of that, I think. Enough preliminaries. Here's the performance you've been waiting for. Proves I am without prejudice and have a fine sense of humor. Sword and crown are worthless here. I invite everyone to dance. Laborers, lawyers, church and gown all make their little prance. This life is full of random deaths and heaps of grief and shame. So few are soothed by accident, you want someone to blame. Fire, plague, and strange disease. Drowned, murdered, or if you please. A long fall down the basement stairs. None are expected, no one cares. I often must work very hard, sweat running down my skin. After the dance, I then must rest, and the eating can begin. Time to eat. Death is the ultimate equalizer. All have the right to be eaten. <laughs> Get a knife, Princess. Don't push. All will be served. So to speak. Wicked thing. Feasting while Wonderland is destroyed. I'm not the enemy you seek, Alice. I tried to hide this bit of Wonderland from that beast. Appeasement's never clean. We must all play our assigned roles. Are you a pawn or a queen? An idiot or a practiced fool? However this turns out, consider the prospect that you've been misled, Alice. Then ask, by whom? No! Who set that bloody train in motion? Where has it come from? It arrived when you arrived, and it's more horrible even than you could currently imagine. The death of a dream! Caterpillar may know how! in my mouth tastes like bile. Where's the brute that hit me, Nanny? Nasty prats out cold. Not dead and more's the pity. What did he want? What they all want. Money didn't earn. What were you thinking, butting into that mess? You could have been killed. Nanny, my mind's in pieces. I still have terrible visions and I need to know. About the fire. Same as always. You need to move on, Alice. So do I. Well, at least she's not spewing that asylum nonsense. My past is dead, I killed them, I should have saved them, I should have died. Her mind was in shambles. Radcliffe thought familiar faces would bring her round. After a year, he lost interest in their inheritance, greedy sod. Still, always asking his bizarre questions. Heavy dose of madness, I'd say, but honest is never the best policy in this life. When she wasn't comatose, she gaped, eyes like pinwheels, drooled, and occasionally squeaked. Never uttered a sensible sound. And like the child she was, she kept her secrets close.
gone off some lurkers, common as cockroaches. And those poor tykes are food for perverts, like the blameless ants that wasps consume or spiders' feeble prey. You visited my room at Rutledge. What you were you... call that? Radcliffe paid me for a bit. A woman alone sometimes does what she doesn't particularly feel like doing. As you know. Nurse Whitless said you'd fallen on hard times. I'm no drunk like her. I'm hurting no one. Hookin's not a bad life. Except for the pimps. She also said you might have my rabbit. Please, Nanny, talk about the damn fire. Never seems to help. Look, Alice, I can't give you what I don't have. Radcliffe wrote the inquest report. I'll take you to him. Besides, he's got your damn rabbit. You should remember that. All right, but Mr. Radcliffe's useless. Don't I know it? All I have to say about the last part is that escalated quickly. <laughs> it got really dark really fast. All right, well, here we are in... She's a rather large hooker. I, you know, I, I, I just, it gets so bizarre. I, I really like that, that part. It just. Get to the ground, Bill. Yeah, I've been scouting around. Nothing in a minute. Place is crawling with rosers since them bleeding murders. Whose work was that? You want to know that sort of thing? You've got to know where to listen. A bit shy today, ain't you? I ain't you, dicky bird. Do your own fucking legwork. I don't know, it just gets so dark so fast. That's why I kind of, like, it, it's so weird. I love it. It's, it's so, yeah. It's the, it's the reason I really want to show you guys this game. It's just, it, I all led up to, it, like, that apex there. And it was, like, it was good. Like, you, like, it's, it just seemed odd. Because something, some, like, nothing bad was happening until then. I don't clear someone's dead here. Ah. Uh. That was definitely a good note to end the week on. I'd be glad to shake your hand, sir. Considering the nature of the goods on offer, it seems more than generous. You do know the way to a girl's heart, don't you? And unless you open your purse a little wider, that's all you're gonna get. Well, I'm sure we can work something out. You might get more if you stop talking. Consider my lips sealed. Oh no, dear. That wouldn't do at all. Yes, who is it? Alice Little, Mr. Radcliffe. Ah, oh, you're back. I suppose you better come up. Mind the latch. Oh, nice little house here. Ancient scrolls of parchment, Indian ink. So he's a very, uh, because he's a psychologist of sorts. Oh, and he's even got a hat. I wonder if some of this relates to, like, Alice's, like, uh, psychotic things, because she seems to use a lot of real world, um, thing, because, you know, it's like, you, you, you think of what you know, basically, uh, you, or like, I guess if you're psychotic, you, you only make psychotic things of things you know, so you're basically like a prisoner in your own mind, it's kind of creepy, in a way. And this is actually, yeah, uh, so this is, um, Japanese, uh, things like, uh, um, Ming vases and things like that. It's like, you're like a prisoner in your own imagination. You do have my rabbit. Forgotten your manners? And what else, I wonder? 
You abandoned it at Rutledge Asylum, my dear. We've been over this before. In a huff as usual, oozing with attitude and accusatory flummery, I've stolen her rabbit. Ridiculous pretext. She's here about the fire again. All the mad child wants to talk about. My report found her family dead by misadventure. She won't accept it. It goes on and on about her killing memories and her need to know the truth. The alleged truth is, the fire began in the library when the cat knocked over a lamp. The blaze trapped her parents and sister upstairs. Sister Lizzie never even unlocked her door, died in her bed. The guilty cat always sets her off. She denies it, makes no sense, it can't be, etc. Agreed. And from the outset, Alice was my candidate for the pyromaniac. The girl had a fixation with fire. I once remarked that I thought she might have had a larger role in causing the tragedy. She suffered some sort of psychotic episode. Did I rip his head off? I wanted to. What's left of my brain will explode. Is it mad to pray for better hallucinations? Perhaps I'm fated to expire right here. So, there's nothing here. My poor rabbit. Why would you even take the, the, the rabbit? That's not nice. I, I want my rabbit. Oh, wait. Well. So, strangely now, this place is completely empty. Completely abandoned. That's, um... Very odd. We don't truly really know what happened here. Well, at least we get this room now. Hey, we can go out here. Oh, not going back there. Wait, I guess uh, we're hallucinating again, because look at that. It's crazy cow thing. And mushrooms that are on fire with that goop from the Wonderland. Yeah, I, I would definitely say this is a hallucination. Can't drink or anything though. This bloody ruin! It's corrupting all of Wonderland! Seeking refuge from the wicked world? Perhaps things only look like they've gone to hell. You're not that good a liar, and I'm not that stupid. But something a bit less calamitous would have been welcome. This unmitigated disaster is your doing, and it will get worse. Your train keeps a hellish schedule. Get moving. Time waits for no one. The change has begun. The train is perfectly capable of terrifying me, Cat. You should find another job. Is there really so little hope? There's even less, and if fear paralyzes you, we are lost. Well, looks like we have a fight here. Alright, let's go get uh, the, this tooth over here before it despawns or something somewhere. I hope I took them all out. Oh, well, I guess I might as well dodge these things. Now we're wearing the nice dress rather than the uh, ridiculous underwater one. Oh, damn it. I did exactly what I was afraid of. Oh. I actually got hit by that one. Maybe I should do that. Like, I should just jump away. Whenever I see that attack. 
let him, let him miss. Oh, there he goes, dead now. Well, I think that's all the time we have for today, so tomorrow we will continue in this. Uh. I don't know. I, I, I can't describe it. Apo apocalyptic. Uh. Wonderland. Looks really cool, though.